Hey Lola George, this is Edmir from Chicago and I just want to wish you a happy birthday and may the Lord bless you with many more years to come. And I'm so sorry that I could not be there with you at the moment um, to celebrate your birthday, but hopefully I will be joining my mom when she heads down there to the Philippines in the later future. All right, so you take care of yourself, Lolo, and you have a good day, okay? Bye. So I have these glass jars here, and I got these at the Dollar Tree. I have four of these, and I am going to decorate them, but I want to make it simple, easy, and you can actually you reuse these uh, jars because I'm not gonna uh, make it permanent. So um, let's get going and let's start with uh, project number one. All right, so project number one, what you're gonna need is, obviously you're gonna need the glass jar. So I also have these stickers from uh, Dollar Tree. Like that. These are nice stickers. So I got these. You're gonna need pencils and this is Kisses, Hershey's Kisses. So we have these stickers here. What we're gonna do, we're just gonna put them in random areas around the vase. So we're gonna put one here, put another one there. Okay, I think that looks good. I'm gonna dump this with our cheap chocolate. Mmm. So, you can either fill this up with um, pencils or chocolate. I like how this came out. Can't wait to do project number two. So, on this one, you're gonna need the glass face, obviously. You're gonna need that. Um, I have the this paper shred, and this is red, and this is um, made by Spritz, which is um, a brand from Target. So this is, didn't cost me that much. It says $1.25, so not bad. And then this one's the floral foam. This one is from, I believe this one's from Dollar Tree. And then this is, these are heart-shaped. Um, behind it, uh, you just have to peel this thing in the back and it's adhesive so it can stick to anything And then I have these two different kind of picks um, This one's a heart Shaped pick with glitter so it matches with that I got this and this one's from the Dollar Tree and then the other one is a similar heart shaped pick, but it has a more of a design So I like that too all right, so for project number two, same process as the first one where um, you are taking the stickers and just putting them in random areas here. So you're going to just put them everywhere. It looks really, really nice, the completed product. All right, so now this is done. What you're going to do, you're going to fill this up with shredded paper. So I've got the shredded paper out already. Perfect. So that one's good. You're gonna take the foam core and you're gonna take the picks and you're gonna put this here in random areas here. So after you created this, you're gonna place this down here and then we're gonna fill this up with more of the shredded paper. So after you do that, you're gonna take these in random areas here. So this one came out really nice, really easy, really simple, and really cute. Easy to do, guys. Now that's really, really nice. I like it, I like how that came out. All right, for project number three, you're gonna need, obviously, the face. I have batteries here. This one is string of light. You're gonna need that. And this one's just a pad of paper. I'm gonna need this. So you can pick from whatever design you'd like for this one. So, and I like this. And this one, I got this from 
Michael's Craft Store. So this is really, really nice. Um, you can see it's five dollars, six something with tax. You're gonna need also scissors, and this is also uh, double-sided tape. Okay, so from this paper bed, I'm gonna pick a design that I feel that it's gonna be good for this project. So I think, yeah, this one looks good. It pops out. So I'm gonna use. So I'm gonna fold this in half. Okay. So after you cut it in half, what you're gonna do is you are going to wrap this around like so and you're gonna use the tape to tape this. That looks really, really good for paper, right? And I didn't even do anything. From this, you are going to take the string of lights. There you go. Let's put that all over here. I'm just gonna cut some random hearts here. Okay. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna take the double-sided tape and we're just gonna tape these things. So this one is complete. So this is project number three. Look at that. It's really, really nice and cute. Wow, that one's nice. I like that. Let's get going and let's finish up with project number four. So obviously you're gonna need the glass jar. And then you're gonna need this right here, washi tape. And this one is pink color with um, glitter. Look at that sparkle, really, really nice. And then this one also, because this one has um, sparkles on it, I, I got this too, put that, there's glitter on there. So this is um, Heart Picks, this is from Dollar Tree. That one's really, really nice. And this one, you're gonna need this. So this is uh, flowers with, um, pink flowers with gems. And this one is from Recollections, and this is um, a product from Michael's Craft Store. What we're gonna do is we're just gonna take this tape, you're gonna wrap it around this vase. Looks good, right? Looks really good, and this is from a tape. All right, so after you have the tape in here, what you're gonna need is, it's up to you if you'd like, you can either just put the picks. You don't really need to have this, but it's an option. I'm just gonna put. Okay, so this is what I did. I added the gems, these floral gems. So I also have this pink shred. Um, I'm gonna use it. Just on here, just a little bit. And then we're just gonna add the picks here. All right, so I think this is completed here. This came out really, really nice. I like it. These are so good ideas that I think that you guys can definitely replicate. Um, these are not, uh, they're very cheap, so they're not that expensive. Most of the items I got here from Dollar Tree, and some of the items I already have at home. Let me know down below which um, one of these do you guys like. Just before I end this video, I wanna give a special shout out to one of my subscribers, and it is Junsel Vlog. I think that's how you say it right there so you're gonna see it right there on the screen Jonasel vlog thank you very much for supporting me and thank you very much for subscribing to my channel all right so till next time i will see you all on my next video